Hello, fellow trainers. I'm Trainer James, and you're watching Pokemon Black Randomizer Nuzlocke. This is episode number 16. Yeah, yeah, because we just faced Berg last episode, and we've been facing gym leaders every five episodes. So, yeah, it's 16. <laughs> and uh, as you can see by the Pokemon layout, our team is slightly different because we lost... Last episode, we lost Noon, our line Noon. And if you missed that episode, I'll link it above. And you can go find out how we lost Noon. But, uh, spoiler, it happened in this gym. <laughs> so, yeah. Fortunately, Noon is no longer with us. But we do have Nurse Joy, the Blissey, on, on, on uh, the squad now. So, yeah. Um, if you look at this real quick, I'm wearing a birthday hat because today's my birthday. <laughs> so uh, go ahead and say hello to good old Pikachu. Pika Pika Pikachu. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so since our team is new, or slightly new anyways, one sixth of the way new, let's go ahead and do a team recap. So first up, we have Vicky, our level 23 Spiel, holding the Choice Scarf, who is still really slow, even with the Choice Scarf. But she knows Powder Snow, Body Slam, Water Gun, and Vacuum Wave. And then we have Nurse Joy, our level 25 Blissey, who is not holding an item. I should definitely give her an item. Um, but Nurse Joy knows Chip Away, Soft Boiled, Vacuum Wave, and Minimize. And then we have Ruffalo, our level 23 um, Corefish, holding the shell bow, who knows Vice Grip, Bubble Beam, Bone Mering, and Harden. And we have Marshmallow, our level 26 Reg Ice, uh, holding the Choice Band, who knows Ice, Icy Wind, Superpower, Curse, and Stomp. And then we have Willis, our level 24 Laron, holding the shell bow, who knows Metal Call, Cut, Bone Mering, and Iron Defense. And then last up, we have Renee, our level 23 Print Plop, holding the Mystic Water, who knows? Bubble Beam, Growl, Metal Claw, and Peck. Peck, Peck. Yeah. So that's our team so far. Um, which means today we get to leave the gym and basically head north. Because if I remember correctly, I think we have a rival battle with Sharon. I think feel like we do. It's spring now because it's September. That's right. Okay, cool. The cross transceiver is ringing. Okay. Uh, who is this? Yeah. Okay. Hey there. Where are you now? Could you do me a favor? Let's have a Pokemon battle. Iris has trained me and I've become a little stronger. I should be able to protect my own Pokemon now. Let's meet at the gate to Route 4. Okay. See you later, James. Okay, so uh, we're fighting Bianca. I thought it was going to be Charon. I feel like you still battle Charon, though. But before I go to Route 4, I need to heal my Pokemon. Real quick. Real quick. Yes. So anyways, like I said uh, earlier, I I'm wearing this hat because today is my birthday. Assuming you're watching this on Friday, September 4th, if you're watching this after, then my birthday's already happened. You don't have to worry about it. <laughs> But uh, if you want to leave me a happy birthday in the comments below, I wouldn't wouldn't be opposed to that. Just saying. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, I am 32 years old today. Oh, I'm an old man, guys. I'm an old man. But uh, you could probably already guess that just by you know, because I'm Trainer James 88. What does the 88 mean? Well, I'm definitely not 88 years old, um, or at least if I am, I look pretty darn good for my age. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, I was born in 1988. Who are you? Okay. Cool. Let's talk to this dancer. Hey, trainer! Show me your paces, give me a whirl! Alright! A fight is like a dance! Well, I didn't know he was going to battle us. Oper Operator Mickey with the Cranidus. Okay. Um, 
Well, this could be terrifying because Kranidos is rock, and I know Kranidos and Rampardos have pretty high attack. Vicky is weak to rock. So we need to switch Vicky out. Um, let's go into Willis. Willis will resist any rock move that Kranidos can throw at us. We also resist takedown. And Kranidos is weak to Metal Claw. Pursuit. No, I hate Pursuit. R.I.P. Noon. Alright, Kranidos is down. Kranidos and Rampardos both have poor defenses. Operator Mickey. Alright, let's get down. How about that? Those are some smooth moves, no doubt. But it'd be even tighter if I had a group. Would you? Hey, you. Would you t Would you talk to the other dancers? If you invite both of them, the three of us can groove as a team. Same outfit as me, that guy's a dancer. All right, all right. So this guy wants us to talk to some dancers. But, um, let's see. I didn't explore these buildings last time, did I? I know Bianca's still waiting for us. Uh, but let's talk to these guys real quick. You can't change the name of a Pokemon you got from someone because the name contains wishes of the person who named it. Hello, hello. I'm the official name rater. Want me to rate the nicknames of your Pokemon? Which Pokemon's nickname should I critique? Oh. All right. So here's what I want to do. Hmm, Renee, is it? That sounds good. It's a very you sort of name. But if you'd like to change it, I can help you do that. How about it? Excellent. What would you like new nickname to be? All right, so I'm going to uh, just uh, shorten Renee down to uh, good old Ren. So now it's Ren. Ren? <sighs> Ren the print club. Ren. Ren reminds me of uh, even... Even Stevens. Did any of you guys ever watch Even Stevens growing up on the Disney Channel? You know, with Shia LaBeouf, Christy Carlson, and Romano? Because so let me tell you something. I had, back in the day, a huge crush on Christy Carlson and Romano, who played Ren Stevens on that show. Let me tell you. <laughs> Her and Hilary Duff oh, had such a huge crush on both of them. Hey, James, you remember the promise you made me on the cross transceiver, right? So, let's get right to our Pokemon battle, but before that... Okay, Bianca, what are you doing? What are you doing? They said we can have a Pokemon battle in the gate, as long as we're careful not to break the electric bulletin board. I'm the new and improved version of me. Let's, or it's gonna go great this time. Let's start up our Pokemon battle again. I hope it doesn't go great, because I don't feel like losing this Nuzlocke right now. That'd be a terrible predicament. Analyst Bianca with four Pokemon. And a Legendary. Of course you would have a Legendary. Um, let's see, it is Dragon type though. I think a powder powder snow is not gonna take a lot of this out. Let's try it. Safeguard, okay. Okay. I'm fine with the safeguard. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This would be like a four hit KO. Psy wave, okay. That does a, like, static amount of damage. Okay. Um, so, Safeguard and Psywood. What else would Latias have right now? Let's try Powder Snow again. Another Psywood. If it keeps using Psywood, I think we'll be fine. But just in case, I'm gonna heal. Um, yeah, let's use a super potion on Vicky. 
Oh, Bianca uses Super Potion as well, okay. I was gonna say, my name's not Bianca. <laughs> Alright. So, let's keep this Powder Snow going. We are Choice Scarfed into it, so... I can't use another move. Not that I would anyways, because a lot of us... Resist Vacuum Wave, resist Water Gun. The body slam might have been good just to try and get a paralysis. Okay, so Latias' wish is gonna go off after this powder snow. And unless we can hit a crit, which would be nice. Please. Yeah. yeah. Way to go, Vicky! Finally, the crit favors us for once. And a rocks, okay. Um, it's, it's not fairy type yet, so it's just psychic. Um, let's see, let's go into Willis. We always go to Willis for psychic types. Willis resists. <sighs> that was awesome. A lot of you guys used the wish. I wished for a crit, and the wish happened to us. Oh, yeah, he, she, she uh, copied our ability. He beats it this rose, okay. Um, let's use cut. Another super potion. We should have seen that one coming. But I wasn't sure how many po super potions Bianca would have. Okay. Let's metal claw again. Look at this. Will us out here just, like, not missing anything. Breaks through confusion. He doesn't care about accuracy lowering. Okay. Willis cannot stay on the fire. Um. Let's go to Marshmallow. Marshmallow hasn't seen play in a while. And Mar and we are, like, right around the same level as Marshmallow, so I can start using him. Or using it, I guess. Good old Flygon. We're gonna Icy win the Flygon. Which Choice Band doesn't work with Icy Wind, but oh well, it is what it is. This is four times super effective, okay, yes. Good old Marshmallow, and a Blade. That is a fighting type. Okay, um, well, I'm going out into red. Red is not steel yet, so we don't have to worry, hopefully, too much about a fighting type. We get a Bubble Beam off. Hoping Bubble Beam will O-code this place again. Okay. Focus. That is terrifying. A focused energy plays again. But it doesn't matter. Red doesn't care. Red's out here like, what? What? Crits? Who cares? <laughs> Bide. Um, do I really want Bide? No, I don't think I do. I think I would rather keep Growl. Yeah, I'm gonna keep Growl. Keep old moves. Yep, give up one bite. Let's see if I can reposition this hat. Oh man, it's gonna come off! Uh oh. Guys, I, I think my hat's gonna come off. Oh no. Bianca! Bianca! Uh, I'll never be a strong trainer like you or Sharon or Iris, but, you know, since we left New Vamba Town, I've been a, I've met a lot of people, and I've been thinking about what I want to do in life. When you look at it that way, Pokemon have given me a lot of new experiences. Having my Pokemon stolen was just really hard, and I felt really unsure. Still, I gotta say, I'm really glad I went. I've learned so much on this journey, and I also learned that being with Pokemon is really, really important. Okay, well, I hope to see you again. Bye bye, James. Alright, bye Bianca. Hope you'll be okay. Oh man, you can see the strength. It's like, oh. there we go. 
I, okay, I, I think the hat will stay on now. <laughs> Alright, so we're back on Route 4. We've already got our encounter here. Is there an item back here? No, there's not. Is there? No, there's not. Okay. Well, okay, so here's Cherry. I don't know. Hey, James. I've been waiting for you to get the insect badge. And now it's time to see which one of us is the stronger trainer. Two rival battles. I knew you battled Cherry somewhere up here. He also has four Pokemon. Simi Seer. Okay. We have Vicky out front still. Um, Vicky's at full health. Is our did Bianca heal our team? No, no, she didn't. Okay. So, okay. Huh. Y'all want a body slip? Oh, you know, I'm just gonna water gun. It's stab and it's super effective. One day, Vicky, that choice scarf will come in handy. One day. <laughs> okay, so one more water gun should take Simi Seer out. Flame burst. This is neutral. Whew. Actually, did quite a bit. Okay, look. Vicky's level 25. Nice. Yeah, Aurora Beam. Okay. Um, 65 damage, 40 damage. Yep, we're getting rid of Powder Snow for Aurora Beam. Akuna. Look at that. Charon stole Bianca's Pokemon. He must have joined Team Blast. Well, it's a psychic type, so let's go into Willis. Like always. <laughs> Good old Muna. It's Metal Claw. The Muna. Yeah. Oh, hey, oh, yeah. And we're immune to the uh, sandstorm damage. Rookadile. Okay. Uh. Uh. Let's go into Ren. I'd like to see Ruffalo come out, but I don't. It's a Crocodile. Bubble Beam the Crocodile. Torment. That's fine. Hopefully this Bubble Beam one-shots. Does not. Okay. Uh, so we have to peck now. Since he tormented us. Ow, ow, ow. Bubble Beam again. Assurance. Okay. Oh no, Sandstorm might take us out. No, 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 please, please don't, please don't. Oh. I hope that level saved us. Thank you, Red. Thank you, Red, for surviving. We, okay, H had we not gained a level, we still would have survived on two hit points. But that was terrifying. Okay, a uh, Lil we'll, we'll Leap is coming out. Gotta remember, this is the Grass Rock type. This is not the Murray that I was mis mis taking it for last time. So let's go back out to Willis. We can Metal Claw. The Lil we'll, Leap. We'll oh my gosh. <laughs> we almost lost Red. And we got the attack boost. Not that it's really needed right now, but... Well, okay. Maybe it will be needed now. Since, since uh, Willie fuses Sinister Gray. Okay, uh, let's... It was needed! 
the attack boost. Willis, you are just like MVP of the team. It's now clear to me. The reason you are so tough is the trust between you and your Pokemon, but that shouldn't be a problem. I get more of Duot than my other Pokemon, too. You have Duot. Good sir. Hello there. James, do you have a second? Professor Juniper. No, wait. Professor Juniper, do you need something? I called Bianca, too, but I guess she didn't hear the call. I wonder what she's caught up in. Well, I suppose I'll just have to call her again later. Okay, I'll be waiting for you two in front of the gate in Mombasa City. Um, hello? Mombasa City's? Mombasa City's gate is straight down Route 4. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go back and heal real quick. I'll meet you guys right back at this point. And we're back. Fully healed team. So let's continue. Actually, you know what? I just realized I could have gone to that house before. I went clear back to the Pokemon Center. <laughs> Deep in the desert ahead of here, at the desert resort, there are some ruins that have become a little tourist destination. Okay, this is not a new encounter, right? We got... What is with us finding fossils? I mean, not that I'm against it, but we have another fossil we can revive. Okay, this... I just gotta make sure that this isn't... Uh, Another new encounter. Rap okay, no, it's still Rap 4. Okay. Okay, cool. So we don't have to worry about... These are getting an encounter here. A wide lens. Okay, cool. I do want to battle these trainers. But, um, I don't know if I'll battle all of them today. An asexual trainer! Whoa! With the next smile. Jeez. Well, uh, I was hoping Ruffalo could stay in, but, um... I'm not so sure he can now. So let's go on to Willis. I know Willis should be able to resist anything Xcloud does to us. Oh yeah, now he's setting up. So let's Metal Claw the Explode. Metal Claw. <sighs> One more Metal Claw, Astonish. We resist that. But he flinched us. Howl again. That's okay, keep howling. Keep howling. I don't care about that. Okay. Shellbell got us back up full, and the Sandstorm takes its cloud out. Willis is now 25. Take down. Uh, uh, no. I don't want take down just because it hurts us. Oh yeah, because we're sturdy. I was thinking, like, do we have the rocket ability? But no, we have sturdy. So now Ruffalo is the only team member lagging behind. Because he's still 23. And everyone else is 25, 26. Ace Trainer Jim! Man, this desert's full of Ace Hunter Trainers. Okay, a Murkrow. So we could definitely stay in on a Murkrow. A bubble beam of our crowd. Get that good old shell bell. Oh, it's a vice man. Astonish. Don't get the flinch! Don't get the flinch. Got the flinch. Holding on. Wait, you're 24 now. Okay. Cool, cool. Um, let me 
a potion on Ruffalo. Actually, you know what? I'm going to use a fresh water. Okay, Ruffalo is back to full health. Um, hey, battle me! Battle me! Actual trainer Anna with the muck. Yuck. As Professor Oak would say. Um, okay, so I don't know what Muck's gonna do. I'm gonna harden real quick though. Just in case. Mud slap. Okay, that's special, so I guess it didn't matter. Our accuracy fell. What's well, Bone Meringue? This would be super effective. Get that. Shell ball damage. Minimize. Okay, so our accuracy is minus one and his evasiveness is plus one. Maybe it's plus two. We missed. I mean, either way, the Sandstorm's eventually going to take the luck out. Yeah, after this next turn, if we don't hit. Okay. So, disabling us doesn't matter. Goodbye, Muck. So if we could get Ruffalo up to 25 before I end today's episode. Actually, you know what? I A spooky plate. Ooh. It'd be great if we ever get, you know, our award. Then his uh, judgment will become a ghost type. Dowsing machine. Okay, so since today's my birthday, I'm going to let this episode go for 45 minutes instead of the usual 30. So that means you guys get an extra 15 minutes of content. Hit that like button if you are enjoying this episode. Ace, trainer, Keen with the Pilo Swine. Now, Pilo Swine is weak to uh, water. We are faster. Get that Shelba. Okay. Mud Bomb. Okay. Our accuracy fell. Um. I gotta heal. Because if we miss Bubble Beam, he lands a mud shot. If that doesn't kill us, then the sand definitely will. Okay, Bubble Beam again. Yes, okay. Ruffalo is not missing. Good. Okay, Ruffalo's 25. Good. Ruffalo is right on par with the rest of the team now. I don't remember what level Ruffalo evolves. I think it's like 30 or 31 or something. Another Sunkern. But we are faster, so I'm just going to run Sunkern. If, if this was like a ground or rock type Pokemon, I would consider fighting it just for the experience. But since it's grass... Where? Where? Where, where? where is the item? Right here? Right here. Black Sludge! Okay, that'll be good if we ever get a poison type on the team. Cause that's that's a leftovers for a poison type. Where? Uh, okay, so it's over there somewhere. Let's battle this guy. Go down there where we can get that hidden item. <sighs> Author Scott with the Musharna. Okay. Well, another psychic type. We're going to Willis. So we don't have a dark type. Nurse Joy hasn't hit the battlefield this episode yet, either. 
So let's Metal Claw the Musharna. Oh yeah, this is gonna take a while. Now your defense, Croy. Luckily we got the Sandstorm on our side. Hypnosis, no, come on, really? What do you have, like Dream Eater? Uh, wow, well, we do have Chesto Berries, might as well use them. I forgot we got Chesto Berries. Ah, that's what I like to see, not very effective. Metal Claw, and we missed. So how are you guys doing today? Today's Friday, assuming you're watching this on Friday. So, something like really depressing about my birthday is that Steve Irwin died today. What I mean, not today, but he died on September 4th back in 2006. So, if we could, a Steelix, that's going to be great experience on, who should I use? Huh. Let's go to Vicky. But yeah, um, Steve Irwin died September 4th, 2006, on my 18th birthday. And I just, I think, you know, Steve Irwin was such like a, a, like a really good person, you know, about um, conservation with animals and everything. So let's, let's just give a moment of silence to Steve Irwin, okay? Moment of silence. <sighs> um, what do I want to walk myself into? Let's do water gun. It's super effective. Okay. Rock. Oh, okay. I was going to say, that's super effective, but... Didn't do as much as I thought it would. Now, I don't know if Vicky is naturally faster than a Steelix because we're six levels ahead, or if this is actually the Choice Scarf coming in handy. But I'm going to say it's the Choice Scarf. <laughs> so good job, Vicky, and your Choice Scarf. Uh, if we get down there... This guy's going to want to battle. We'll come back and battle him. Uh, how do I get... How do, how do you get down there? Guys, I have no way. I don't know how to get down there. Uh, what do you want? Uh, I don't mean to brag, but I'm a dick pro. I'll give you this TM so you can use it too. Okay, Rock Wrecker is an extremely powerful rock type move. And it's supposed to be dig, which means that... Willis can learn Rock Wrecker. The, the user launches a huge bull earth target. It must rest on the next turn. Okay, so it's like... It's a Rock-type hyper move, basically. Oh my goodness. And Ruffalo can learn it too? Okay. Let's teach Rock Wrecker to Willis. What do I want to give up on? Um, I guess I like iron defense, though. Alright, we still have the TM for Bone Meringue, so if I decide I want Bone Meringue back, we can teach Willis Bone Meringue. Let's teach him Rock Wrecker for now. Um, and then, should I... Teach Ruffalo Rock, rock Wrecker as well. <laughs> Get rid of Boomerang though. So okay, so Ruffalo. No, Ruff, Ruffalo is weak to Electric. Boomerang is great for that. So I think I'm gonna keep Boomerang on Ruffalo. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm not gonna teach Rock Wrecker to Red. Thank you, kind sir, for uh, this uh, awesome TM. 
Sandstorms are terrible, but rock type, ground type, and steel type Pokemon can weather a sandstorm without damage. Thank you. And rock type Pokemon also get a special defense boost in the sa and in while in sandstorm. So this whole time Willis is getting like a special defense boost. Offer Zach with the Hippopotas. Um, okay, so let's bubble beam you. It's an Oka! Good old Ruffalo! way to get up? I don't think you do. Do you? Oh, you do! Okay. Let's see what this uh, Princess Peach wants. Good ol' challenge by Princess Peach with the Voltorb. See? This right here. Boomerang is going to help us. No, Voltorb might be faster. Sonic Boom, okay. Voltorb was faster. But Boomerang should take Voltorb out. <laughs> we don't even need the second hit. Okay, um... Who else do you have? Oh, why not? Um... Ooh, ooh buddy. Uh... Let's see. Whoosh. Darn it. Um. Do I go out to Marshmallow and use a Choice Bandit Stomp? Wait! Duh, we just taught Willis Rock Record the perfect time to test it because if why not lives um, we may lose Willis rock marker okay please please y yes Willis okay to have had a live card. I would have actually, well, no. Live card is also pretty high. Um, are we faster than a live card? No, we're not. Fury swords. Okay, okay, okay. Stop, stop. Thank you. Okay, so I have to switch. Um, let's go out to red. Wrench should definitely be faster than a life card. Of course, a crit. And you hit five times. Jeez. Pursuit. You know, 
growing up, I always thought Mawile, like, Mawile is Steel, and then in Gen 6 it becomes Steel Fairy, but I always thought Mawile was dark. Like, it just looks like it should be a dark type. Um, so we can't stay in. So let's, you know what, let's go into Nurse Joy. Nurse Joy hasn't hit the battlefield yet, so. And plus we have Vacuum Wave on her, which would be super effective. Joy, you got this. You got this. I have faith in you. Vacuum wave. Awesome. Hmm. A sour pants? Wow. Um. Nope. We go right, into, right out to Marshmallow and use that icy wind. Four times super effective. Your Intimidate does not bother Marshmallow. Hopefully, nothing else bothers Marshmallow. Headbutt. This could hurt. Okay, but I got the punch. Okay. Now, I know... I think Salamence has Ember. Range. Okay. That's fine. You shouldn't live this Icy one. I can't imagine you living an Icy one. Okay. Cool. Gengar. Let's just stay in. We can icy win this Gengar as well. Curse. Hey, hey buddy, that's on you. Just cut your HP in half. Goodbye, Gengar. Ah. Now Marshmallow is level 27. Leading the pack. Okay, let's uh find this item. Actually, you know what, real quick. I need to heal. I can't believe we have two fossils. Uh, yeah, let's Super Potion Ruffalo. And Ren as well. Okay, there we go. I feel safer now. Uh, no. I need the dowsing machine. Oh. I just want my item, man. That's it. I just want my item. Author Shelby <laughs> with the Weedle. Awesome. A level 20 Weedle. Could you imagine Ruffalo taking an explosion? from a Registeel only to die to a Weedle. What's Bubble Beam? Oop. And it's a one shot. Okay, let me grab this item. Dark Void! Aw, oh, too bad we didn't have Petey still on the team. That's his signature move. Who could earn Dark Void though? Could have used a Lucario. I mean, Lucario is part steel, which is also weak to fight him. Um, are you gonna be fast enough to run? Yes, you are. Okay, cool. What? A water gem. Okay, cool, cool. That'll power up a water attack for one time for single usage. And a Reaper Cloth, another item we do not need. Can you want these? No, you can't. Okay. Um. Well. Well. I guess that ends pretty much everything here in the desert. Now, a Winkle is something I would put on the team, only because it's part flying, which means it resists fighting. Even though it is four times blue to a lecture.
can't run from a Wingo, but we can run from a Lucario. Okay, sure. That's another Pokemon I would have liked to have had on the team. Awesome Staraptor. Can't lower us, though. Let's run. Let's heal real quick. Thank you, kind sir. Of course, you run into a Pokemon. Picks. You know what? Let's wobble beam it. <laughs> Just because I know Ruffalo can take it out in one hit. Get a little bit of experience. Awesome, awesome. So this episode is going to be more like what, 50 minutes instead of 45. But still, hey, it's. It's a birthday episode, okay guys? It's a birthday episode. Do we... I think Relic Castle is this way. Yes, the Desert Resort. Okay, so this is a new encounter. So, I am going to save that encounter for next episode. <laughs> Give us something strong to start off with on Monday. And if you guys enjoyed this episode, this uh, you know 45, 50 minute long episode, um, remember, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I want to thank you guys for being here. We're at 124 subscribers right now. I'm hoping we hit 125. Um, well, I'm recording this on Thursday, so this is September 3rd, so I'm hoping by, by the time this video goes up, we have 125 subscribers. Um, but if we don't, we don't, you know. Um, but anyways, I want to thank you guys for sticking around, thank you for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day, and may Arceus bless you. Alright, bye guys.